Graney. The trip. And here is Powell. Back to Doncic. And Davis pulls it down. Los Angeles leading by three. Lakers passing it around. Vanderbilt with it. Pass to Davis. And they double up Davis. Pulls it up. Ball entered from the low of the basket. That was ball. Mavericks trail by three. Greg, what a remarkable run from the Dallas Mavericks in that 2010-11 NBA season. And some say it's the toughest title any team has ever won. When you consider the juggernauts they took out, including the big three of the Miami Heat in the NBA Finals. The putback. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. And those second chance points really become almost like bonus points when you can get them. Takes a step back. Pass to Doncic. Williams with the ball. Over in the corner, Green. Now the Lakers on the break. Here's LeBron. Finish off the break. When, when LeBron gets the ball, guys, and there aren't numbers back in transition, it almost always results in an easy hoop. Now, here is Irving. Stolen. And here we go. Fast break. James has got it. Here's Davis. That one falls. His second basket of the game. He's now two for three. Watching Davis run up court, very light on his feet for a big fella. And it'll be the Mavericks with their first time out here of the game. Number 42. And the Mavericks with possession here. Seven point differential. Pass to Green. And here is Kleba. He's guarded by Russell. They double him with Russell. Just five on the clock. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for the Lakers. And they've made a point of pounding the offensive boards, turning those rebounds into points. It's been a great effort. He's off on the second. We know Greg L.A.'s challenge recently has been finding the right supporting cast for their star. And they're looking for that perfect fit. And sometimes that's all it takes, you know. It's finding those perfect one or two other guys to get you there. James. Tries again. Donchich with the steal. Pass to Irving. On the wing, Donchich. Now, Kleba, he's guarded by Davis. Out to Doncic. Irving for three. Drills the three-pointer. Irving's got seven points. Boy, the shot clock near zero. There is no doubt Irving is connecting there. He seems very assured in low clock situations. And those are the kind of nice inside looks they've gotten here in the first half. Here's Irving following the basket by Anthony Davis. In the corner, Holmes with it. It's stolen by Davis. Inside. Whoops, they pick off the pass. Here's Irving. Score the basket. His fourth. He's only missed one of his five shots tonight. But what a wizard Kyrie is in the open floor. Utilizes his speed to help create open shots in transition. That's beautiful. Yeah, not sure what that was about. I mean, talk about a brain cramp. Outside, Russell. 
Launches a three. They grab their own miss. And that's a pure hustle play, getting to the offensive glass for the tip in. And that's the kind of quality you see in any strong offensive rebounder, isn't it? And they double up Doncic. And here is Kleba. He has yet to score. Now, here's Doncic. Anthony Davis grabs the miss. Great rim protection to prevent him from converting. Beautiful. And the dunk by Vanderbilt. Well, the more repetition he gets, the more floor awareness you develop. D'Angelo Russell showing a desire to get his teammates involved. Now, here's Doncic. And the dunk by Doncic. And didn't do anything fancy there, but didn't need to. Nope, he, his only concern right now is getting the points on the board. And I, I don't mean style points. Lakers working the ball around now. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Well, Doris, some question is, you know, the move that Dallas made last season acquiring Kyrie Irving. They gave up a lot for sure. Boy, they sure did, Kevin. And it was a high-risk move that obviously fell flat. For this organization, it has been trying to get the right mix around Luka Doncic. That is the key for them to succeed. On the wing, Hardaway. Doncic feeling it out. Pass to Kleba. And Kleba slams it in. Well, you want some unselfishness from a guy who's capable of scoring. And Tim Hardaway says, you know what? My teammate's open. I'm going to get him the ball. Here's Davis. To the middle. Here's Vanderbilt. Can't answer back with the dunk of his own. Out to Hardaway. Three-pointer. Drills it from outside. And now, just a two-point Laker lead. I just love how confident Tim Hardaway Jr. is from long distance. This guy will cash in from there. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. Now, here's Kleba. And they double up Doncic. And the ball's tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. Here's Kleba out to the right wing. We on the clock. Let's go. And it's Dallas with another. So far, both teams scorching the Nets. You gotta love it. Well, you love it when you can get off to a fast start offensively. You hate it, though, when your opponent does the same. Now, here is Davis. Ten points for him. Sweet move. Hits the layup after the sweet pump fake to freeze the D. Davis has got 12 in the game. And Davis shoots a high percentage because he's so adept at playing to his strengths. Here's Hardy. Here's Doncic. And it's Russell with the rebound. And the way he was able to reach out towards that release had an impact. Well, no question. He altered that shot. And most of the time, that's just as good as blocking it. Here's Reeves. Scoreless thus far. Here's Davis. And they double up Davis. And it's Davis finishing it off. And when Davis gets going, you are in trouble because he will just power through you to get to his spot. Now, here's Doncic to the paint. Let's the three fly. Vanderbilt with the rebound. And they had some botched coverage that turned into no coverage. Also looking it over. Here's Reeves. Sinks the triple. And now it's a nine-point Laker lead. 
And I like Davis's decision making. Fantastic. Always great at understanding when to move the ball. Here's Hardy. Hardy. And they come right back with their own three point. The real come at us, and we're coming right back at you. And you would expect nothing less from these two taking pride and making plays. Right wing. Fifty six seconds left to play in the first quarter. Here's Lively. Dallas needs to get off a shot. And here's Doncic from the arc. And he's good on the three ball. Doncic is got five. This guy's so calm under pressure. And then the awareness of Luka Doncic knows where the clock is at all times. And they double up Davis. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. 16 points for him. Feeling it. No doubt about it. He's definitely feeling it right now. Shooting a terrific percentage from the field. Now, here's Hardy. He's got five. Now, Doncic. Pass to Hardy. In the corner, it's Kleba. Boy, you love the hustle from the young guard. Angelo Russell making the play with the defense. And they're scoring pretty well as we conclude the first quarter. Lakers on. And thanks again for tuning in. If you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter of action so far. And taking a look at Los Angeles' performance here, what have they been doing or not doing? Well, one way to generate more offense, pound the offensive glass. That was the difference in the first. I love the determination. They want to go after every rebound out there and overwhelming to the opposition right now. And now we've got some time to check in from the sidelines. You got for us, D.A.? Thank you, Kevin. LeBron James last season passed Kareem Abdul-Jabbar to become the NBA's all-time leading scorer. LeBron says, that record was never in my head because I've always been a pass-first guy. So it was never a goal of mine. Kevin, there's perhaps no greater tribute to James's all-around game that he could set that mark without setting his mind to it. Back to you. Well said, D.A., thank you. Outside Hardaway. Pass to Williams. The kick out to Irving. To the left wing. Puts up a three. Here's Powell. Who's back up. And they call the foul. So he's got the and one chance here to make it a three-point play. The Mavericks do their third free throw shot of the game. And, and their free throw percentage as a unit last year, 76%. Right around the middle of the road. You know, when you look at the game of Dwight Powell, Doris, he's sort of a throwback big man, isn't he? I guess so, Kevin. I mean, he's a little retro for sure. He does a lot of his damage right inside the paint. This guy is focused on getting rebounds, setting quality screens, only taking high percentage shots. So I get sort of a throwback. Four on the clock. Fades away. Here's Davis with the clock winding down. And he makes that one. Davis has got 18 points in the game. Well, just it's easy to say, this guy wanted it more. Creating the second chance opportunity and cashing in. You know what? Tried to step in and cut him off, but just didn't get there quick enough. Now we'll do the lineup. Your winner. Number 35. Pass to Hardaway. Outside Irving. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Their biggest lead of the game was not to the left side wing. In a wide open look for Hachimura. No good on the three. 
Irving with the ball. Nine points in the game so far. Outside Williams. Dallas moving the ball around. Hardaway with a wide open look. Cans it from downtown. Nine points in the game so far. You can see the kind of confidence Hardaway has in his shot. This guy is so fluid in the catch and shoot situation. LeBron is doubled. Pass to Wood. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. Hey, the league is now, Greg, on any given night, we sometimes see a team fall flat. Is it just the luck of the draw? Sometimes players are tired, and sometimes they relax. You know, this is why leadership is so vital. Setting that standard for others to follow. Back to Hardaway. On the wing, Green. Outside Hardaway. Outside Williams. Outside Hardaway. And here's Green outside. It's hauled in by LeBron. And I think that one could have easily have fallen for him. And here in the second quarter, that changes to approach four minutes played. Well, they are daring him to miss, and he obliges. Outside, Green. On the wing, Hardaway. And here's Irving. He's got nine. Puts up a deep three. He misses it. He's four for seven from the floor. James with it. Now Green defending. And the wide open shot from Reddish. Gets the three point of the fall. Reddish has got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Out to Hardaway. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. It's proving very difficult to guard Tim Hardaway Jr. without fouling the guy, especially when he's this aggressive. Greg, looking at the history of the Lakers, they always feel they're a title contender. And they've been to the finals in every decade. Their longest championship drought in L.A., just 12 years. So, to me, the best franchise in NBA history. Well, Brown is such a student of the game. This guy knows exactly how to get the defense reacting and hits the open man. Now, here's Doncic. And they double up Doncic. On the wing, Hardaway. Back to Williams. It's going to be a 24-second shot clock violation. They turn it over. Lakers leading by seven. Here's LeBron. Oh, LeBron's just too strong inside. A monster down low. LeBron James, the rare package of skill, size, and athleticism. Pass to Williams. And James pulls it down. Boy, this guy is a good finisher, so he misses a chippy. That's tough to take. Back to Vincent. Down low. Here's James. LeBron powering inside. Well, LeBron James, we have seen it for years. The ability with that frame, that athletic ability to finish through contact. Bumped on the way up, but hits it. And they call the blocking foul. And when he breaks out the crossover, you can be sure he's going to leave somebody in his wake. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the game here. And when it comes to Luka Doncic, he's simply, Greg, one of the best players in the entire game. No question about it. He's a threat to record a triple-double every time he takes the floor. As versatile and dangerous a player as there is in our league. Here's Wood, and the Lakers tack on two more. Well, Christian Wood has all the moves when he's close to the cup. That's a pretty look right there. Doncic. Rebounded by the Lakers. 
pass to Vanderbilt. Back to Vincent. Kicks it out to LeBron. From deep. And again, it's the Lakers from deep. You see there's a hesitation to close out too hard on LeBron. They don't want to see him get downhill. But that three-point shot is on point. And it's green. Missing. And even without that three ball dropping for him, the defense should have done more on that last play. That's his first personal foul. Third team foul. Wood is double. Pass to Vanderbilt. Three pointer. And LeBron James good for three. LeBron's got 12 points in the game. Here's Doncic to end the run and the basket is good and he's got a chance here for one more at the line well the hoop and the harm Luka Doncic the finish and he'll get an opportunity to add to that the Mavericks have made four free throws from the line and missed two Doris when we look at the Dallas Mavericks it looks like a team that has shown they want to win now Kevin, I think their ownership has never been afraid to pull the trigger on a big trade. The Mavs are not about just making it to the playoffs. This is an organization that seeks the ultimate prize, and that is to win an NBA championship. Now here's LeBron. After Luka Doncic's miss, James with it. Now Green defending to the paint. Picks it out to LeBron. Shot clock at six. And again, it's the Lakers from deep. We often see LeBron James with the ball in his hands, creating for himself or others. That time, a little catch and shoot. The easy one for LeBron. On the wing, Green. Out to Doncic. And here we go. Fast break. James has got it. And they double up James. Pass to Reddish. James looking it over. Here's Vincent. Whoops, there's the 24 second shot clock violation, so they'll turn it over. That was long. And here's Williams now. He'll bring it up for the Dallas Mavericks. They trail by 18. Here's Doncic, and the wide open shot from Green. Offensive rebound, and here's the Lakers. 18 points separating the teams, that's the biggest lead of the game. And they double up LeBron. And the dunk by Vanderbilt. I'll tell you, that vertical ability he has puts him in select company in NBA power forwards. May not have great size, but boy, he plays bigger than it. Basket counts. Well, the tight handle allows Luka Doncic to make the pretty move off the bounce. LeBron outside. And they double up James. And that's a foul called on Josh Green. That is his first foul of the game. And the Mavericks making a change here. Now, here's Reddish. Down to five on the shot clock. The Lakers need to get a shot off here. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Now, here's Doncic. Pass to Holmes. He tries for three. And the three ball is good. Holmes got his first three points of the game. Now, here's Davis. And they double up Davis. And finish off by Davis. Yeah, the added muscle Davis has put on, helping him on these tough finishes. Flexing on him there. Out to Doncic. Shoots the three. And it's Anthony Davis with the rebound. Lakers lead by 17.
And they double up Davis. Shoots over Holmes. And Davis can't get it to go. Here's Kleba. Pass to Holmes. Doncic right side. Impressive work inside from Doncic. This has been one of the most elite, consistent scorers since he entered the league. Luka in the house. And here is Hachimura. Offline with his three. And here's the fast break. And Kleba slams it in. Assisted. You see Kyrie never hesitates. As soon as he sees that open man, boy, it is on time. Outside, Russell. And they double up Davis. Inside. Out to Russell. This one for three. Kleba with the rebound. And out of bounds as the Lakers gain possession. That almost looked like bad communication. You hate to see that kind of mistake. And timeout call. Jason Kidd has had enough. some changes here. Nineteen seconds left in the first half. Pass to Davis. To the inside. And finished off by Wood. How about Christian Wood finishing with authority? Okay, young sir. Here's Jones. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. And so it's Los Angeles finding a 15-point lead at the end of the quarter. What a night they've had in terms of their shooting. Everything dropping in for them. We'll take a quick break and then back to the action here. And as we dive into the second half, we'll find out if the next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it has been a runaway. Now, here is Russell. And they double up Davis. Out left to the wing. Six on the shot clock. To the middle. Takes the assist and lays it in. Pick out the pass nicely. Russell's got seven. Well, you like to see D'Angelo Russell work his way to the inside. Proves he has some touch in the paint. A three-pointer is right on target. Oh, the defense has to stay attached to him on the perimeter. Outside, Russell. Pass to Davis. With one on the clock. Wood. Out to Russell. Davis sets a screen. Loads it up for Davis. Hammers the alley-oop through. Really encouraging to see D'Angelo Russell make these passes. If you're going to be effective as a point guard, you've got to run the pick-and-roll game. A shot by Williams, no good. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Powell with the steal. And oh, here we go with three. Nobody down. Well, Powell understands the value of igniting the fast break, getting easy baskets for his team. Nice active hands. Now, here's Reddish. Pass to Davis. And they double up Davis. Outside Prince. Six to shoot. Lakers passing it around. Shoots from 12. Russell. And it's Russell with that extra effort. Russell's got four points now in the quarter. You know, to me, it's huge when D'Angelo gets to the glass. This guy has the ability to use his athleticism to his advantage. And Davis sends it back. 
inside. And stolen by Green. And now the fans break. Doncic with the ball. The Mavericks have gone 5 of 7 from the free throw line in the game. The neat thing about Kyrie Irving is you get style and substance. This guy's such a fluid player, makes the game look effortless. Pass to Williams. And stolen by Russell. And there's the call on Kyrie Irving. That is his first foul of the game. His first personal foul. First team foul. A little over two and a half minutes off the clock in this final half of play. Back to Davis. And they double up Davis. To the wing on the left. Taken away by Williams. Only one player gets credit for the steal, but really both defenders made it happen on that one. And it's Russell with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. Their defense has only allowed six points in the second half. Yeah, gets a finger on it, but just can't quite come up with the steal. But a really good read on his part, being disruptive at the defensive end right now. Prince misses. Mavericks trailed by 15. And they double up Doncic. The kick out to Williams. Pass to Powell. Now Irving. Second shot opportunity. Good work there as it goes. Irving's got 12 in the game. You are not going to find too many better in the mid-range than Kyrie Irving. And there's another turnover by the Lakers. Mavericks making a switch here. In the third quarter with just over three and a half minutes off the clock. On the wing, Irving. to Powell. The kick out to Williams. Powell inside. Outside Irving. And the officials call him for a three-second violation. And that is just a deflating error on his part. Well, I think it kills your energy and it certainly kills your momentum. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Oak. David. Thank you, Kevin. This Lakers franchise, of course, has a lot of championships, but they know that nothing's given. Coach Darvin Ham said that that ring and them banners don't come if you ain't on your thing. You've got to be focused and make every day count. Talking about championship, championship. At some point, the lip service gets old. You've got to go do it. Kevin, back to you. Got to go do it. He's all about action. David, thank you. Now, here's Irving. 12 points for him. Lock at six. And Davis sends it back. At this point, finding blocks comes naturally for AD. He just anticipates and attacks the basketball. And taking a quick look here at the hustle stats for the Lakers. Great job by this team closing out. Blocking a bunch of shots and just a tremendous effort defensively. Here's Irving. Hardaway for three. The shot comes out. Pass to Reddish. Here is Davis. And they double up Davis. Donchich with the steal. And the dunk by Donchich. I'll tell you, some people question the athleticism of Luka Doncic, but boy, he loves to dunk on occasion and let you hear about it. Now here's Prince. Still scoreless. Back to Davis. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. Yeah, the defender all over. He's had four chances at the line, made them all. Had a success rate from the line last year of about 78%. He makes one of two that time. And a member of the NBA 75 team, Anthony Davis is the rare franchise player, someone you build your entire organization around. You know, Doris, guys like Grant Williams are so vital to the success of the team. He doesn't get too greedy, does he? 
No, Kevin, and the key for role players is being willing to star in your role. For Grant, he knows what that means. He's got to be versatile defensively, and he's got to knock down open shots. He's willing to do both at a high level. The kick out to Williams. Here's Rich. Had the opportunity on the break, but couldn't sink the three. Irving with it, and it's Reddish picking him up. Back to Irving. Pass to Hardaway. Jacks up a three. Another three for Dallas. And they have been relentless from deep. And you see the defense trying to react, but to no avail. Well, that's the whole point, isn't it? If you space the floor well enough, it's almost impossible for the defense to account for everyone. And here is Prince after Tim Hardaway made that last three-pointer. Two on the clock. 14 feet away. And it's off the back rim. No good. Williams double team. In the corner, Irving with it. Another three for Dallas. Yeah, this offense is rolling. They've been assertive, but they're also playing under control. I think the communication on offense is working at every level right now. What a run for this group. And there it is for him. Russell's got six here in this quarter. You have the sense that D'Angelo Russell likes to play through contact. This is a tough-minded player. There's a screen by Williams. Dallas moving the ball around. Here's Doncic. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. Doncic has got 19 points. I'll tell you, they're right in this. We'll see if they can maintain momentum. Probably the most important thing is they regroup. They worked out some of their frustrations, and now they're starting to have some fun. And it goes out of bounds. A last touch by Irving. Dallas making a switch here. So the Lakers call timeout. They're first. Timeout called for the Lakers. All right, fans, get on your feet. Make some noise. It's T-shirt time. Here's James. 15 points in the game. Shot clock at five. Dash to Vanderbilt. Good work defensively by Holmes. Mavericks trail by nine. Now here's Hardy. Launches it. Another three for Dallas. Well, there's an unpredictability to his offensive game. He is always keeping the defense off balance. Out to the wing. Here's the three. Sinks the three-pointer. Reeves has got six. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. Well, that three-point shot just gives you so much room to operate on the offensive end. Hardaway for three. That one is good. He's only missed one shot of his six taken on the floor. Making a huge difference from deep tonight. That was a big-time shot. That's where the bulk of his offense has come from, and they're going to need a few more of them before this one's over. And they double up James. A putback. Here's Vanderbilt. From the arc, and another three for the Lakers. Such a boost to this offense when this guy can knock down uncontested threes. Taken away. LeBron galloping to the rack. The ability to sustain productivity over the entirety of his career. LeBron James is a modern marvel. Master Hardy. The shot's good on the assist by Doncic. And that's 11 points for Jaden Hardy. And guys, there are some you can give that shot to, but, but let's be clear, he's not one of them. Terrible job there by the D. Now here's James. 
He's got 20. A shot's good from Hayes. And that's LeBron, one of the best front court playmakers. That is something you just can't teach. Astor Hardy. In the corner, Holmes with it. Over in the corner, Doncic. With some arc. Eyes a three. A rebound by the Lakers. They led the game at one point by 20. Here's James. Makes it off the glass. And it's a 12-point Laker lead. Want easy looks? Don't allow the defense to set up. What a beautiful fast break opportunity and the finish pretty good. Brunel as they have shot 75% at the stripe, six of eight. And good on the second, so he makes them both. 58 seconds left to play in the third. Here's LeBron. Goes back up. LeBron playing like a big man inside. Well, LeBron James showing incredible energy to get to the offensive window and keep that play alive. Here's Doncic. Hardaway goes in. And then Hardaway with the dunk. And cutting into the lead with the big one-hand throw down. That's how you get your team back into it. Thirty-two seconds left in the third quarter. The tray. Vincent misses. Mavericks trail by ten. Doncic to the rack. The Mavericks have shot eight of ten from the line. That's an even eighty percent free throw shooting here. And the Mavericks call time here. Shooting for Dallas. Luka Doncic. Please put your hands together for your Lakers regular. Give it up one more time for your Lakers Lakers. That free throw good from Doncic. What you love about Luka Doncic is he's this unique combination of size and skill. He could really play cross positionally. He makes shots at all three levels so dangerous. Driving the lane. Hayes, no good. Now, Doncic, 21 points in the game. Hardaway from outside. Terrific job from LeBron. Keep his hands up, his feet moving, gets the challenge on that shot. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers. And with three quarters behind us, let's see what this fourth period holds in store for us. And so Doncic will bring it up for the Mavericks. Eight point game. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. You can see Luka Doncic has the body, the handle, the footwork, and the savvy to draw fouls. That is nicely done. He doesn't get the second one. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. It's going to be on Kyrie Irving. That one is off. Well, probably a little draft in the arena tonight. He's the last guy you expect to miss the mark by that Absolutely. Now, here's Doncic. And, yes, it's good. Doncic has got nine points here in the second half. That's a high percentage look for Luka Doncic. He is a menace if he gets that deep. On the wing, Irving. And the assist goes to Doncic. Irving's got 21 in the game. And this is the game plan for him. He's a big part of their floor space. And right now, Greg, he is doing a great job delivering for this team. Productive and efficient. Screen by Kleba. And here's Doncic from the arc. Just five to shoot. 
and no good. Had a chance to take the lead there. The Lakers in the lead. An intentional foul committed, but for what purpose, Greg? I'm not sure. It's a scene of confusion right there. I can't imagine why he thought it was a good idea to foul there. The T got there too late, and he'll go to the line. What's remarkable about LeBron is the complete command of the game. Not only his team, but you'll hear opponents joke about how well he knows their plays. And the Mavericks making a change here. Now here's Irving. Irving double team. On the wing, Green. Here's Hardy. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. And he knocks down the first one. Both shots good from the strike. Just over a minute and a half played here in the fourth. Here's Vincent. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. A free throw drops for Vincent. And so Vincent nails both of them. You can tell when he steps to the line the kind of confidence he has in himself. It's written all over his body language. Powell with the screen. Irving looking over the floor. He gets it in there. Irving's got five points now this quarter. Boy, how frustrating it must be when you manage to slow up Irving only to have him drop the floater. He's an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. He is, and he picks the simple one-hand stuff to get the two points. The first one falls. And both free throws good for LeBron. Mavericks trailed by six. Outside Irving. On the wing, Green. He gets hauled in by Los Angeles. They led the game at one point by 20. Outside, Russell. Pass to Davis. And they double up Davis. Six on the shot clock. In the corner, it's James. And they force the shot clock violation. Great team. Mavericks ball. Mavericks substitution. Number 77, Luka Doncic. Now the Mavericks with it. They trail by six. And they double up Doncic. And there's the foul. And it's on Dorian Prince. That's his first foul. And the next one puts him in the bonus. Mavericks making a switch here. Substitution on court. And D'Angelo Russell picks up the foul. That'll be his second foul of the game. That's his second personal foul. The fourth team. Outside Irving. Powell with the screen. Five to shoot. And block. That one goes careening off the glass. Outside for Davis. Back to James. And the dunk by Vanderbilt. Oh, inflicting some punishment with the two-hand flush. Ah, they're going for the throat. Tim Hardaway Jr. got that one up quick. Hardaway has got 11 points here in just the second half. Well, when Tim Hardaway Jr. starts to cook, the confidence goes through the roof, and he's working right now. Over to the left wing. LeBron outside. James with a powerful jam. LeBron James goes high in the air and absolutely no doubt about how that's going to end. On the wing, Hardaway. Another three for Dallas. And all of a sudden, that three puts them in striking distance, guys. He's had that shot working all night. 
Yeah, and if he can stay hot from out there, his three-point shot could be the tool they use to win this game. Here's Doncic following the bucket by the Lakers. It's Powell on the wing. Back to Doncic. That shot misses. Great D that time from Davis. Lakers lead by six. Outside Russell. Here's LeBron. Making the most of the screen. That's how it's done. And it's in the perfect spot, Greg. Frees him up to get all the way to the bucket. Where was the defense? No fighting through the pit. No rotation. My goodness. A shot by Williams, no good. And you don't want to give up that kind of look too often. And they double up Davis. Out the basket. And now a 10-point Laker lead. Uh, unwilling to let up, even for a moment. That's his killer instinct, just fanning the flame. One thing I enjoy is watching players who don't pay attention to the score. You lock in on the moment and play the right way. And this is what dominating the glass looks like. He just cannot be contained. Wow, what a performance. And he's not just winning with physical ability. He's winning with anticipation. <laughs> he just powered that one down. One of the game's top dunkers. Irving with a clean look. Dallas again missing. And so it's Davis. He'll bring the ball up for Los Angeles. They led the game at one point by 20. In the corner, Irving with it. Out to Hardaway. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. Hardaway has got nine points now in the quarter. Heavy incoming from beyond the arc. A key part of their initiative this entire fourth quarter. It feels like they have worked their perimeter game to perfection. Swinging the ball, cashing in from the outside. What a performance. It's been like this all night for both teams. The offenses having their way. And it is a major disadvantage down the stretch if you can't guard. This may just come down to who has the ball last. The kick out to Irving. Another three for Dallas. Nice little run here to shrink that deficit. But can they get over the hump? Yeah, it feels like they've ramped up their intensity. They have forced good things to happen. Now they're back in it. They seem to concede that shot. And his response is, thank you very much. Back to Williams. Pass to Doncic. Dungeon throws it down. Big hops from the backcourt. Oh, absolutely. And maybe just what they need to get this game GA going in their direction. Boy, as tight as this one is, that's a statement play saying, hey, listen, we're not here to back down from you guys. At the line for Los Angeles. And so Anthony Davis nails both of them. Average trail by five. Doncic with it. Powell with the screen. Back to Doncic. Outside Irving. And there's the drive. And Davis pulls it down. It's tipped. Here's LeBron. And he goes right over Dwight Powell and slams it down. LeBron James, ever the showman with an exceptional slam there. One of the best dunkers in the history of the game. Now, here's Doncic. And Doncic throws it down. A oh, power flush with a long hang on the rim at the end of that. That could, be, you know, that could be a catalyst for him. It really could. And they double up Russell. Dallas calls timeout. Look at LeBron James. He's really been playing well. This is a timely timeout because this guy is hurting them. They've got to figure it out.
And while we've got a moment, let's send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldridge. David? Hi, Kevin. Well, Jason Kidd going over the plan with his team for the last few minutes. Set in the huddle. We've got to play some defense in the paint. They're getting too much in there. Battle down low. Time to fight, guys. All right, thank you, David. Now, here's Doncic. Shot clock at six. To the inside. Here's Williams. The shot's good on the assist by Doncic. Yeah, Luca, just a preternatural gift for finding the open man. What a pass. LeBron outside. Loads it up for Davis. Up high to stop the alley -oop. Stepping up, Davis is a fantastic option late. You, you know with that height and skill set, he's going to get a good look. Now here is Hardaway. Pass to Powell. Doncic right side. Banked in off the glass. Doncic has got 15 points in just the second half. He has been taking and making big shots for a long time. Luka Doncic with the delivery. Down low, Davis. And it's Davis finishing it off. There is an imagination, a creativity. This guy's passing drives the offense. Doncic right side. On the wing, Hardaway. Finish with the ball. He's picked up by Irving. Vanderbilt shot is good. That's about reading the floor. Hits his man right where he wanted it. And Doncic, here we go. That one drops for him. 28 points for Kyrie Irving. We all know that Irving wants to be the man to hit that shot. And when he takes it, he usually finds a way to finish. Here we go. Wow. First free throw is good, and that increases their lead to six. And the second free throw, no good. A tough break there. And now the fast break, Irving with the ball. Yeah, the way Kyrie varies his pace, hard for any defender to guess right. Here's LeBron. Here's Davis. It's rebounded by Dallas. Doncic. It's stolen by Reddish. LeBron with it. He's picked up by Doncic. And so it's going to be a three-second violation out there on the defense. And the technical free throw is good. You know, sometimes just standing up there by yourself, it takes even more focus to drain the technical, but it gets it done and adds to their lead. Now, here is Russell. To the paint. And LeBron throws it down. Relentless in their approach, even with the game firmly in hand. This is a textbook example of playing the possession and not the score. This team is doing a great job continuing to execute. Man, that is a good one. Kyrie really just comes alive when the game gets tight. And stolen by Russell. Five seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Yeah, there's not a person in this building who didn't know the ball was going to LeBron, and still he delivers. Here's Doncic. Count it. And Doncic relishes the opportunity to deliver in big moments, and my goodness, embrace the spotlight, young man. Nice touch there near the hoop. Hardaway for three. Pass to Doncic. Let's it go from deep. It's money from deep. So it's Los Angeles taking the W in a close. That was a fun night of basketball. Fabulous.